Hey guys, uh, it's my second video now. I'm just showing you how to change your hard drive in your PS3. I hope you watched my last video just to make sure you backed up all your data before you change the hard drive. Uh, so once you get all that stuff done, continue to this one. But if you've already watched it, great. So the first thing you want to do, obviously make sure your PS3 is turned off. And you want to unplug it. I'll start that right now. Alright, so it's shut off. Just unplug it from the back. Just to be safe. And you want to go ahead and you've got on the left side uh, just a kind of a plastic casing. Easy enough to apply off with your fingernail. Take it off. And you normally have three screws. You got your sil two silver screws that hold the hard drive into the into the bracket itself. And you've got one more that holds it into the PS3. I've already got mine taken out from a couple of attempts to make the video. Uh, basically you just take this prong right here before you take out these silver ones. Slide it forward, pull it out. It's pretty simple. It's kind of hot. It's really hot. Um, and just take take these screws out so it's out of the guard. It's probably one of the simplest things you could do changing your hard drive. Just I've yet to find too many accurate videos on YouTube. So I thought I'd do it. Plus I'm bored. So you basically take it once you get your screws out. Pull the hard drive out of the guard. You can throw your hard drive out or destroy it or keep it or whatever you want to do with it. I don't care. My girlfriend's laptop broke a couple weeks ago and uh, the hard drive's still good in it. So I took that out and it's, uh, it's 250 gig. So basically you just want to Push that into your guard, grab your two screws, and you just want to start screwing them back in. I lost my screwdriver, so I gotta use my fingers. So yeah, just screw it in. Again, I hope you guys can understand this is pretty basic. It's my second YouTube video though, so sorry if it's crap. And just tighten that up. Alright, so once you got it in into the bracket, you basically just want to make sure that you've got this side facing the back, obviously, and this little pull thing here is facing out. Slide it in, take this out, and push back so it's locked into place. It's in the in the place there, in the thing itself. After that, make sure you put your, your blue screw in. Mine's out in the kitchen somewhere. Got to get that after, and you just pop that on. It's really simple. After you get that done, I'm sure some of you might want to know how to put the data onto this hard drive. So you just want to go. You should probably plug it in first. Alright, so it's plugged in, turn it on. I'll turn on my TV. And my room's really messy. Alright, so let me put this up here really quickly. Alright, so next thing you want to do is make sure your hard drive is plugged in, get it all turned on. And you want to go over to game again, go to save data utility, uh, click on USB devices. As you can see, I've got Modern Warfare 2 is on there right now, that's from a while back. Uh, just basically, yeah, just go up to the USB devices, click on that. And you get your Tom Clancy's Hawks, you want to copy that over. It's basically just triangle copy. Go down to Oblivion, like it says, my girlfriend's file. Copy that over. And 
my all-time favorite Black Ops. I just want to copy that over. Really simple. Other than that, you guys officially know how to put a new hard drive into a PS3, format it, and uh, it will transfer your files over, of course. Alright guys, thanks for watching. If you liked the video, please subscribe. I appreciate it. Have a good day.